in order for you to get water and food you have to go and show the mark they are going to be controlling the water supply and the light are you hearing me i'm happy to report that in the upcoming financial year the government will make available 10,000 polyethylene water tanks god i got a the rising legend Represent for Talk Your Mind TV. If you love Talk Your Mind TV, bet me a rest of God, a God. Talk Your Mind TV, anything them say God here, and anything them do God say, before them even think at him, know what them think. Wow, go on, my diehearted viewers and subscribers. One of the with diehearted Jamaica, my deep divers. One of the with big up on yourself. But my viewers and subscribers, you know, must not forget that Kevin Smith did a warn me about this way I come. And you must not forget, say, the government of Jamaica assassinated Kevin Smith for speaking out on the corruption we are going within the government. And you must not forget, when Kevin Smith was going to say, you can't buy and sell without the QR code. You know, water go control everything, you know, food go control, you know, see. Beryl come and bring famine from Jamaica. You know, see, so you know, no water and you want to stick up the water pipe them out, of the, out of the dirt from Negril. West Mall and them now no water. And you know, Andrew wants them to go around and take up the pipeline them. And you know, see, so the real bank president come and talk about hurricane and hurricane come destroy you know, GDP in double digits. And you know, see what I go on. And you know, see, so then take out Kevin Smith because I'm talk too much. My viewers and subscribers, you know, must not forget the things then that Kevin Smith did attack. Then I put it out say Kevin Smith did a gay. That is not a breaking news because all of the politicians them in the Jamaica Labour Party is gay. From the one where I drive the bus down to the yard now, all of them are gay. Remember, Andrew wants to take money for promote bottom, so he must be a gay too. As a matter of fact, I want to hear this from Kevin Simmons. In order for you to get water and food, you have to go and show the mark. They are going to be controlling the water supply and the light. Are you hearing me? I'm happy to report that in the upcoming financial year, the government will make available 10,000 polyethylene water tanks to needs assessed households across Jamaica, starting with a focus on the areas most affected by the drought. Households on par, households recommended by MPs and assessed by the Ministry of Economic Growth and Job Creation will qualify for the tanks according to the rules of the program. All the tanks issues issued will be placed on our national GIS database. This will be a five-year program with the objective that every water-vulnerable household must have storage and rainwater capacities, capabilities to withstand drought and water service disruption. Drought and water service disruption. So, Madam Speaker. You will wait and see. May I tell you, sir, you will see it with your eye, but you shall not eat there. After you will, at the time that you think you will see to eat of it, you will die. Die. There will be no more cash. Cash will crash. You have something now called artificial intelligence. Very soon, this position of a, a human being exchanging cash and so on, that is going to disappear from the banking system. And you are going to have to interface with machines. I don't want it to be a scary thought, but it is a thought that we all have to embrace. It's all those people who are working at the airport now that think people need them. You will be replaced. There will be no need for you to be there. <gasps> so, my viewers and subscribers, I want to see why the government assassinated Kevin Smith. I want to see why the government assassinated Kevin Smith. Because he did not talk too much. He did not talk too much. Andrew Wallace must come out of Henry Morgan House. We must take out Andrew Wallace out of government. By force, if we have to take him out by force, we have to take him out. Hey, I'm a deep divers. On the sister Nigel Clark and Andrew Wallace now I try to thief up the funds where we help with burial, the damage the burial create. Now they want to talk about now are the wrong fund them get them take out. Because are the wrong fund are the fund of them forget and I eat them get because the iron reach Jamaica so them now but I get the fund where them should I get. My viewers and subscribers, may I tell them something you know. You see people in the diaspora on an office in a dollar that Jamaica give nobody at all. Without no family or no family. On an office in a dollar 
go give them. Make them stay and bear the hungry and that my baby don't die the hunger. Lick them, then we have sense and know say yo, Andrew Honus and in front of my thief too much money. A thief too much money for them can't do it. Fix up all the country. I'm I telling you again the people in the diaspora. I don't know if it's not that like a Jamaica give nobody. Without no family, yes or no. Everybody have to just bear the hardship for good. If you don't want good, you don't have to run. If you don't want old time people say, if you don't want good, you don't know have to run. So you don't have to really make the hardship matter about everybody. If you don't want to wake up and say, who know the government? And because me some people are car, but Andrew Honest, please, maybe you come in and me come. I don't know if you tell Andrew Honest, but no, please come no way. I don't know if you, I don't know if you beg. Let me tell you something. This time I'm not beg the government to come, come and look upon the damage that show that show the government them now say you don't have no sense. You don't never know. When you not beg government to come, come look upon damage that show the government say you don't really have no sense for true. So because them find out they don't have no sense, they're not going to treat you like idiot. And then the diaspora, they're not going to them say they're not going to be able to know. The people in a foreign country for the whole land for their money and their resources and make whole of Jamaica just dead for hungry until they wake up. It's it. Fire mama, Rasta, daddy, auntie, it's on way, you know. But all the time people say if you want good, your nose have to run. So the diaspora people just focus on them business with them do and keep it moving. I mean the Jamaican people focus on for them business and keep it moving. Until then we up and know say them supposed to get more from government and then the top tech sell out and buy out and pay out. Hey. Mr. My viewers and subscribers, remember think more dirty Niger clocks and have everything covered, you know. Big dirty nose and Joe and they say have everything covered, you know. 900 shelter, the dirty big nose man say have, you know. Active, you know. 900 shelter, man say have active, you know. And people that do sleep now, you know. People are sleep outside right now, you know. People don't know if they sleep right now, you know. And the man say have 900 shelter, you know, my viewers and subscribers. Mr. The Jamaican people forgot to take out and Joe and they sort of parliament. The Jamaican people need to lock down the country now. Lock, lock, lock down the country. Lock it down. So for the 21 family program and Joe Honest, we are going to find out. The country needs to lock down now. Enough of your business as usual. The people that move so selfish. Can you imagine? There's a hurricane. I have people outside a party in a hurricane. People are playing football until youth end up down. My viewers and subscribers, that show you the level of the people them holding down. This show you a dumb, 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 dumb set of people. See? So when they Andrew want to say, all them have to do, I promise them hope. And him go around and promise them hope. That's all the people them want, you know. Jamaican people don't need to lock down the country now. From Cribbis to Kana, lock it down. Enough of your business as usual. The country needs to lock down until Andrew want to say, but you know, any other business Andrew want to do, as government business, with the palm pass now. Every money for direct to if you build up at Jamaica, every single dollar that the government have right now to turn to develop back the country from burial, every single, every one, every single dollar, every single hour oh, oh, taxpayer money, every single dollar of the taxpaying people of Jamaica and outside of Jamaica, that all of that money for turning a burial for fix up at the place, every single dollar, everything else took up on pause. Every single thing else to go up and pass. My viewers and subscribers are full time now with demand and show these public servants say, and them run things that we run things. Remember these dirty drunk shit back them in a them concrete house and all them thief up much money and billing you know? them. I wanna deal with Jamaican people. Rise up now. I wanna rise up now and lock down the place. I wanna rise up and lock down the place. For blood or blood, anything or anything, you know, rise up and lock down the country. If you don't want to go to the nose of a run. If you don't want to go to the nose of a run. A matter of fact, I want to hear this and I want to tell me one thing. Hear ya. I came across an article which was published a couple of days ago in the Jamaica Cleaner. It's read Finance Minister Dr. Nigel Clark says the government will have to draw on the Resources available in at least two financial instruments it put in place for emergency response and recovery costs of natural disasters. These are the Contingency Fund, 
and the natural disaster fund totaling 4.5 billion i assume that's jamaican dollars now immediately as i read that i remember leading into the hurricane there were several announcements that jamaicans need not worry because the country has a catastrophe bond that will cover any damages that would incur during the hurricane and then it dawned on me and i said wait but so what happened to the bond and so it, it leads me to ask some other question was there an actual bond and if yes what were the conditions under which the bond was held or in other words how do we qualify for benefits from this bond and in all of this by the way what is a catastrophe bond now in order not to be prosecuted for spreading false news propaganda and misinformation on social media i set out to find answers to these questions and one of my main sources was bloomberg now anybody who don't know what bloomberg is that's a a global news agency they have television station radio station they are in the they are involved in a multiplicity of business they have the first globally right the first global 24 hour business news radio station and all of that right so they are very well recognized around the world and that was the main source of my information now what is a catastrophe bond by the way a catastrophe bond is a form of insurance right and it has to be issued by an, by an insurer right that seek to gain funds in in the event of a natural disaster to help recovery right and so these disasters include earthquake tornadoes tsunamis tropical cyclone which an hurricane is right and so to answer my first question was there an actual bond the answer is yes jamaica has a bond to the value of 150 million us dollars and this bond was, was was taken up by four global investors and the issuance of the bond was facilitated through the world bank so there is a bond well here's the gist of the thing now how do we qualify for benefits from this bond? now i don't know how many of you are familiar with motor vehicle insurance one motor vehicle insurance there's a thing named excess where the owner of the vehicle have to bear a part a portion of the cost if the vehicle should um crash or something like that right now the excess amount whatever it is the insurance don't cover that so if the accident if the damage from the accident is below the excess amount the owner will have to stand their own cost if it's over the excess amount they will only pay the amount that is above the excess because the owner will still have to stand that portion of the cost now an ex i am not saying an excess is attached to the bond no but the bond has conditions which is similar to that so there are conditions that have to be met in order for you to qualify for the bond now what are some of these conditions right now they have what is known as a parametric data right or a parametric trigger and the parametric trigger is what determines if you qualify for benefit from the bond or not and so in order to arrive at this parametric trigger they use what is known as a parametric grid right now what is this parametric grid persons who are familiar with topographical maps will know about the term grid squares so if you look at jamaica on a map what they would do they would set a, a, a series of grid boxes covering the island of jamaica okay and they would they would select a critical part which would be the center of the, of the thing and they color code it right now in order for us to qualify for that bond for for benefits from that bond one the jamaica had to suffer a direct hit from the hurricane and how we consider a direct hit the eye of the hurricane must pass through one or more of those grid boxes. In this event, beryl did not. The eye, of, the eye of beryl did not pass through any of those grid boxes. The second condition is, even if the eye of the hurricane passes through the grid boxes, the hurricane have to be of a certain pressure. 
doesn't come with a certain force, right? In order for you to still benefit. So, in other words, it can pass through the grid boxes and you still don't get no benefit because the hurricane is not power, considered not powerful enough to create significant damage enough for you to benefit, right? And so Jamaica had not met any of those conditions and hence we will not benefit from having that bond, right? And I'm going to read just a quickly, just read from the Bloomberg, uh, from a Bloomberg article here, what it says. It says, investors in bonds intending to help Jamaica cover the cost of a natural catastrophe won't be affected by the overcrowd by Hurricane Beryl, even as the Prime Minister declares the entire Caribbean island a disaster area. Okay? So basically what they are saying is that the investors won't, won't be bearing any cost, right? Whenever we meet, meet the criteria to be qualified for, the, for, the, for benefits from the bond. Okay? So my view was on subscribers. And as you say, uh, I want to move the Aguan from the Royal Bank President come telling about hurricane can destroy our GDP in double digits and go back. Uh, one year after Jamaica double digits destroy my viewers and subscribers. You know, so these things are planting. I want to just look how Beryl is an intelligent storm, hurricane. He makes sure say Governor and Senti go destroy the food basket. I want to just look how the storm operates, you know. Kingston get no, uh, no no damage, you know. And I you know if you remember how Mark Golden did a one you know, about Andrew Wallace and his shopkeeper of a wife when he have as host speaker in the house and him a prime minister and Jamaican people they make Andrew Wallace get away with this and it's a conflict of interest. And so comes he has six teeth in the parliament when I want to talk about. But if he thinks we're gonna talk about him, make a sad mistake, a matter of fact, we're gonna talk about it right now. And I'm going to make Mark Golden talk about it again. So to make sure you no listen to this. Um, as I tell you, you no, need to come out and lock down Jamaica. And if you reach to the point where I forgot to take Andrew Wallace out of Andrew Morgan House and make him cease and desist from doing the Jamaican people them business. If I just say reach, I just say reach. I'm going to hear this. When the former speaker was forced to resign as, re as a result of an integrity commission investigation, the, the move to replace her with the wife of the Prime Minister so that the head of parliament is now the spouse of the head of government really does not sit well with the tradition that the speaker must act independently of the government of the day. The speaker, the speaker is intended to be independent and must act independently of the government of the day. That is the tradition. That is the, that is the tradition. The failure, the failure... The failure, Mr. Speaker, members, 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 the so-called illicit six MPs. So, on the year Mark Golden, some of my viewers and subscribers, and all the way this take place, only reason why this take place is because Jamaican people them dumb. 
we have a set of dumb people. Ma, um, the Prime Minister find out that we have a set of dumb people are rule over. So you can't do anything. Because the people then put politics in the end, everything. There is no way. Juliet should have been the host speaker and Jonas the Prime Minister. That's a conflict of interest. Corruption will go on. But the Jamaican people don't have no sense. Then politicize everything. That is why I'm telling you know, the diaspora people for me, they, they stay on dead for hungry. I might be one time hungry, start beat them now. Then we start demand, then we start do the right thing when they're supposed to do. But I advise everybody in the diaspora, don't waste no money. Don't bother wasting no money so I say go help nobody at Jamaica. Make them stay hungry. When they're hungry, then say, oh, hungry man is an angry man. Maybe when they then get hungry and the anger come out, then we start opening their eyes and say, but wait, don't want you want this space so big and them have for how much money we have black attacks and them have how much money and we can't get no night. Maybe then tell them we wake up. We don't make them stay and bear their hunt and burden. The people in my night in the diaspora, I don't see even the money because I remember say we have big fishy fries over here. A lot of things are going on in the foreign country the same way. See? So I just focus on you know, just focus on you know, for a bit. And the Jamaican people them focus on themselves. And maybe by the internet they will have sense. As a matter of fact, and you want to say if the people them they have sense, they more than keep him in the power. Because if you want keep, to keep him and the Labour Right Party in the power, the baby them not going to stop dead. And I said, and you want to say it out time out. If you want to keep the Labour Right Party in power, the baby with them not going to stop dead. He said it out of his mouth. With that mistake, he make a remote slip, but the truth him attack. I want to hear what I'm going to hear this. Talk your mind. Bless up yourself and your family, you know? But, you know what I'm saying? I listen to one speech where you play over and over where the Prime, Prime Minister said, um, in dream, him dream, same ear babies a cry. Then him say, the, in a the dream again, in here, them I say, the people them, I say, why them have the JLP party still in power? So I think that is an indirect speech him I give them, so it's like, he might tell the people them what they do, but it's like the people them not read it. So, being as they not read what go on, him just go put on the pressure upon them, see him where. Because if him say, why them still have the GLP in power? I tell him, I tell the people them, say, them if they do what they have to do, if they take them out of power, you know. So if they go wait till election time, he may go put on everything with the pan in plan pan the people them so they have to the people them have to wake up you now and do what they have to do. Because he, he, he tell them you know, but to them not nah, read it, him just a act to the others them when he have to carry out. Yeah. I saw me I see it. Yeah, and there's another thing again when he say again, you know. In, in, in a one for the first part of his speech again when he say he's unwilling to act against any minister like where the public disagree with, with whatever them do. So if him said that, anything where a minister do, him now go draw them up, now, now say nothing to them. It, it, it's like it's okay to him. Because him say it already. Say him, him now go act against them. So if them know that they can do anything and him now go come out for say, well, boss, you know, say you're wrong for do this or you're wrong for say that or whatever happened, it shouldn't happen under your portfolio. No, because him already tell the people them say he's unwilling to reprimand any of them, minister them. So the people them now listen. Yeah. So on a year with the GSMI if you was on subscribers, I'm a gonna find that video there and play me on a year when Andrew wants to say if the Jamaica Labour Party, if the people them keep the Jamaica Labour Party in power, the baby them now gonna stop die. In gone bed and he wanna look at baby crying, 
crying, say, why did the people them have to keep the Jamaica Labour Party in power? And I'm my sister, Andrew, and my sister. Andrew forgot her prison is a thief in boy from Spanish town without apology. We don't read Andrew on this. So when he come to my catch at all time, big stinking nose about him, I got track down vlogger. Go track down all of these to go pick me them when miss out of Jamaica where you can't find. Go track down Daniela Dan, 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 Rowe killer. Go track down Daniela cops. And if you can, I'm going to chat with your father because they say your father is a jacket. Your father get jacket. Or the man who wants get jacket. That's if you go chat with and move up. Hey. My viewers and subscribers, Kesha Park Gully resident. I call upon Dutty Stinking, Desmond Mackenzie, and the big nose drunker. I want to hear this. Stinch Stink Nook, Chuck Bowen in Cap. Come out and come, Kesha Park Gully man. Chuck and Chuck needed, yes, sir. Mackenzie, Prime Minister, everybody, yes, sir. Come on, you see that? Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Make him fly in here. So, yes, I want to dump emergency. 50 chokey has their country. Yes, I need emergency. No. And you're in love with yourself in next year and him can't fix back. No go there. No go there. He can't fix back this. So, he must try to rectify it before it's done. I think that's life. Life, punch up a life. Do your best thing. Come dump it back and fix back here so before it gets to a further. Alright. Rub them. Dump uh, that blood. Tell them if I have a cherry garden. A cherry garden, I don't just. I know, bro. I know, bro. Dump it. Don't really. Really. Yeah. Quick to a speed. It's a bit dumb. Bumbo wall. It's an emergency dump. Oh, man. I don't want people to live here. No. No, no, they have to dump it, you know. See them have to get mal from where them to get mal and come dump the gully. Go, Jack. Eh? You know what I'm saying? Me and Spain almost a choke with a gravelly night, what you? This gun! No, me tell him. You, and, you, and you come in like say, come in like say, I seen, we seen it to blood clot like it. How will you put this down here for? Right now, me love to see Prime Minister Pankasha Park Bullybang. Me no. love to see him. Need to see the Prime Minister. He's put out effort to dump the gully emergency. The me Prime show. Minister. The Prime Minister. Right. I'm responsible all things with star mash up. But in a response to it. I didn't buy stamina, man. Mackenzie a long time no come boy, you know. He no come and catch a park. <laughs> Who the boss there? He no come and catch a park and rain fall. Bully wash me. Mackenzie and the crew for dip and catch a park, bully bank. Man, just see how get dip. He no say how many damage. You don't know him no come here yet. See? So, when you hear that, my viewers and subscribers, the resident them a catch up park, them said a the gully. It get big like Pat Wall and Juliet Wall and Sharon Wall and Dan Wall. So the master the government needs to come do something urgent. Because if them wait till the next shower or rain come down pony, it now we can't fix you now. So my viewers and subscribers and look for this nice house for the Where the PM thief money and bill. You know just look for the house here. Peter Phillips said, we ain't get the money from Phyllis house here. He come out and say, Peter Phillips, bad man. But Andrew Ones are the first Prime Minister in Jamaica where bad man get a youth. Andrew Ones, bad man. He bad man so till he knows the top grow. He bad man so till he knows a big cover and face like what? So Andrew Ones, bad man. I'm going to show you in our next video with a bridge in here say, this drain here a 10 feet deep, concrete drain, everything. And because Andrew one of them decides to them now and clean it, 10 feet of drain full up back to the brim, my viewers and subscribers. Can I, just, just imagine a drain where 10 feet deep and a couple of feet wide, full up with dirt and mud and backer and rubbish and all type of sitting. I'm going to take a look at this. I'm going to get my peeps. So one drain yeah. from Olivia over 20, 30 years now. This drain never been clean. Matter about never been it full right up to the brim as you can see at the brim that so me I can all the way that's the drain in the people and storm tomorrow and then Andrew Wallace had do this and I do that and then this is some people come here from there and we are negotiate and no more on to look at this drain yeah wanna look at it good that, that that's the, that's that's where the dirt is right now just look at it good more wanna take a good fucking look at it that's where it is the drain right now. The people live here and all these things. This is the road. 
Although around here don't look like now. Let me go right here make you know. Alright, see how far the drain full up come here. I mean I talk I want little drain. This drain is ten fucking feet. Ten feet down. This drain is ten feet. And then come here this morning and we are discussing discuss the price for clean the drain. And I said no, they ain't doing it. They have the money and them not do it. They say make the rain fall where I come and clear the drain. There is no rainfall that can clear this drain. The rainfall will constantly rain and it come out on the road. So people may have beg you know, make this video go up for me because right now to the state I will see the country in a wanna look in you, know, you see it? The drain take time I come down wanna can't see the wall now. Alright, we're going up same way. People get way to school. School. Little primary school. Um no, no, um, you call it infant school. Look, alright. This is a little infant school. And the drain is right here. Little B A B C one, two, three school. Here it is. Right. And look look at the drain situation. Right? Look at the drain situation. Look at this. I know from when me I walk to you know people. I know me not reach the bottom of the drain now. This is all clock drain right now. See there again? Clock drain people. And me I go show you how far down the drain is. Here is where the drain start from. Here is the bottom of the drain. And if you get a tape measure and measure, you can see. Here is the bottom of the drain people. I want to take a good look. See the bottom of the drain? See where it started clogged from? It started clogged from this side. So somebody have got under this hole, clean it, go straight through. You understand what I mean? So, the rest of the drain, it's not church. The rest of the drain going up looking wonderful. Nice and properly done. You can see. Alright. Look where the drain clog is from. You know. I mean, I thought this thing around 30 here. 30 year old right now. This drain don't clean. Remember tell us none at all. It don't clean. Alright, we're going back to here again. See it where it start? So you know said we the first start from here. Try to find the, the furlong of the drain from here. Going down. You understand? Going down on here. We are finding that the drain is getting higher and higher and very much higher. There's a black tag and P. This is for the kids. This this can and I click, look, look at where the school is and look at that hole any accident can happen any accident so I'm begging you people please please if you don't can donate something I don't have to wait for Andrew Wallace if you don't can donate something please me I beg you just donate something and we'll see if we can do this by ourselves like where we can buy some shovel and pickaxe to try to dig this out before this time, this time at tomorrow, you know, and we talk about this thing a lot. When we say we talk about this thing, we talk about it a lot. And there is nobody but today they came and they take a look on the drain. You understand? And it's totally crap. Look at where the drain is now. Look, it's almost almost on the road. Almost on the fucking road. Call it it's on the road. That's the drain. I'm making you see it back, people. That's the drain. Morning again, my peeps. It's one drain, yeah. From Olivia, over 20, 30 years now. This drain never been clean. Matter about never been. It full right up to the brim. As you can see, at the brim. Yeah. So I can all the way. That's the drain, you know, people. And storm tomorrow. And then Andrew Wallace said, do this and I do that. And then not. We see some people come here from there. And we are negotiating. And no more. No. Look at it. That's where it is the drain right now. The people live here. So, my viewers and subscribers, what want you think about this here? I'm telling you, so the people them from Lockdown, Jamaica, the, pe the people them in the diaspora, when you don't say nothing about Jamaica, we get nobody. Make you hungry, bite them down there, and then they will wake up. Because one time people hungry, you know, hungry man is an angry man, they will come to their senses, and they will start to hold government accountable. 
I remember everything I'm telling you in a previous video. When you see these people coming in the community, you don't know what to do already. My viewers and subscribers, when you see these think more drunk or shit bag MP and counselor coming in the community, you don't know what to do already. My viewers and subscribers, I'm a matter of fact, I want to hear this from Kevin Smith again. <laughs> I So, my viewers and subscribers, you know, see what I'm going on? As Kevin Smith talks, him carry the Governor General go somewhere. The police them switch off the camera and done the video. My viewers and subscribers, if you did not listen to Kevin Smith and just rub flag flag down this 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 controversial um, argument where DPP come out with both um Kevin Smith is a gay he must get charged in Canada for a molestation. DPP, how much people, how much are your friend them in the Labour Right Party? You know is a child molester. I want you to come out and talk much of your friend them with the, in the Jamaica Labour Party is a child molester. Child molester. Come, 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 come tell Jamaica how much of these MP in the Jamaica Labour Party when a government in a Henry Morgan house a child molester. Almost all of them are child molester. All of them travel look a boy and look a girl. That is why Del Rachuk don't want to, 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 to make the sex offender registry be public knowledge. But then can't hide no more enough from the Jamaican people, everything I reveal. And this is the next video. I gonna show you say Andrew Wallace now spend so much money to put in an internet system where it now got to use. So a lot of the Jamaican people and I better tell Digicel and Flo bye bye. Because of the information I weigh and Joe is supporting the whole on up and when control the information wanna receive and put out. I'm to listen to this again. Why should the government spend scarce taxpayers' money on free internet? After all, most people are using the internet only for entertainment. Isn't that so? To download games, to go on social media websites, to go on the gossip sites, to watch people dancing on TikTok, and I see all the kids smiling. Because it is true that there are many vehicles traveling on the information highway. 
and we choose to go in some of the vehicles that are not carrying us anywhere. But on the information highway are vehicles that can uplift us, elevate us, that can take us to places that make us better people, that can help us to fulfill our dreams and aspirations. And so the government is interested in ensuring that every Jamaican can get access to the information highway. Because information that you convert to knowledge that gives you wisdom is power. As our country evolves into a digital country, as our society moves to become a digital society, and what, what do I mean by this? What do I mean by becoming digitalized? It means that the provision of services that are usually in a form where it has to be paper-based, which means that you have to physically access the paper or document, which means that you have to physically take the document and carry it to somewhere in order for a service to be provided, that you have to physically turn up, which means that you have to engage transportation, you have to interact with the public, which means you have to be there at a particular time. It makes the service kind of analog. One thing can't happen without something else happening before, and you have to be there physically. But as we move now into the digital world, where documents in particular become portable without being physically transferred. We have a representation of the document in the cyber world, as they call it. And it moves through the air in waves, being received by instruments that have a representation of the document. That you don't have to be there for your form to be handed in. You don't have to be there to collect a check. You don't have to be there to make a payment. Nowadays, it is all possible to do it virtually. Or, as we say these days, we do it online. So, my viewers and subscribers, I don't hear what this big nose actually have to say. Both you want to digitalize Jamaica. You don't know who forgot to digitalize. You don't know who forgot to digitalize. My viewers and subscribers, one of the stuff make Andrew on his feel like he have so much power. He don't have the power and thing where my purchase. Say so he have. He don't have it. He don't have it. He go look head with some of these real leader, dictator, real leader, and come back and try to practice. He not going to work for me, brother. He not going to If you know the Jamaican people, then what me you know. You stop going around the world and make these people make a ton fucking idiot. And I embarrass yourself. You need to lift up out of the government and go. You don't need to lift up out of the government and go. Because when time, hey, it's when time the revolution start. You see when the revolution start. You can't beg with no pardon, you know? You can't beg with no pardon, you know? One of those blood clot member that and do right by the people them. Cause most of the things that we are gonna fuck up this time. That's who kids them go suffer. This fu the future generation of Jamaican go suffer. We now fuck up this time, you know. We're ready for revolution anytime. You think we are fuck up this time? You think we are make way our ancestors them fight for go down to Jane. I go I go to waste. And wheel and come again, you know. When I don't know my when I don't know my my motto already. A God and good road. We we'll clean up Jamaica and take out this parasite. Because Andrew only is an Indian. I operate like Jamaica will to them. Like their mama and their daddy did own Jamaica and will long to them. So we are going to find out if Jamaica the will to Andrew only is an Indian. We going to find out if Jamaica the will to them. 
Love God and live here, man. God and good word. God and God. Talk to mind TV. I oh, you mean? The artist news, artist review, and the baddest TV channel right across the world globe. Watch this, the man. Talk to mind TV. Watch the man. They're at top TikTok. Talk to mind TV. They're at top Facebook. Talk to mind TV. They're at top Instagram. Talk to mind TV. At top YouTube. Talk to mind TV. All over the globe. Family love. Talk to mind TV. But be very say God and God. Don't subscribe to Talk to mind TV and say God and God. Don't press the like button for Talk to mind TV and say God and God. I will Say God upon them. I want to start share a like. Talk to mind TV. You over there, please subscribe. Yeah, you pretty pretty. Yeah, me please. Me I beg you subscribe. Yes, and you in other city. Yeah, we I beg you like. Yeah, touch the share button.